I'm in a parking lot on the corner of Cherry Street and Cesare Chavez Avenue in downtown Grand Rapids where two people were killed, one injured in a shooting early Sunday morning. Not the only one police are investigating from over the weekend and in both cases still searching for answers. A lot of families uh, have been devastated and, and impacted by this and uh, yeah, heartbreaking is the, the word I'll go with for this weekend. It was a rough one. Candid comments from Grand Rapids Police Chief Eric Winstrom. His department looking into two separate shootings. The first involving three men in their 20s. It happened just before 1 a.m. Sunday in a parking lot near a couple of bars downtown. Two are dead, the third hurt, and he is expected to make a full recovery. It seemed that these individuals knew each other. They uh, knew each other very well. This is not a case of a, it doesn't appear to be a robbery or a, a violence against strangers. This group uh, of three at least all had some connection to one another. Winstrom says it appears the three shooting at each other were the only ones involved and it's unclear what the motive might be but officers recovered three firearms from the scene two handguns and likely a rifle. There's a firearm in one of the vehicles that was there just walking around looking in, in the windows there were vehicles which were hit by gunfire that's evidentiary value so it's possible that they were towed uh, for our forensics teams to to pull apart you know to get the bullets from the vehicle. This incident followed by a separate shooting that took a 15 year old's life three homicides in one day, matching the total investigated by GRPD the rest of the year combined. Last summer we had a, the, the whole month of June, we didn't have a, a homicide in June. It's been years since that happened, um, obviously. So three to start the month is, is heartbreaking. This was a heartbreaking weekend for us, especially coming from the start of the year that was so peaceful statistically for us. The FBI says on average, cities should have about 2.3 officers per 1,000 residents, meaning a city of Grand Rapids size should have about 400. GRPD is only budgeted for 304 and is still 18 hires away from even hitting that number. But the chief says that should be changing soon. As we've increased staffing, uh, downtown has been uh, one of our priorities for high visibility patrol. And um, once we start reaching those um, budget goals, You'll see more and more officers, and I think you'll see not only a, a greater feeling of safety, but actual safety as well. Chief Winstrom tells me they are hoping to speak with witnesses to uncover any other information for both this shooting and the one that happened on Grand Rapids Southeast side. Uh, we have information on how you can do that and do it anonymously if you prefer with the story on Fox17online.com. Reporting here in Grand Rapids, Max Goldwasser, Fox 17 News.